Hello Cinephile, my name is Matt McCucci and this is my Cinephile Corner, where every day I bring you a quick but insightful review of a randomly chosen movie in two minutes the layeth. Some are famous, some are less known, but all opinions are my own. Fire up an audio teeny and listen to the audio waves as they fly through the air. Today's film is Spaceballs from 1987, directed by Mel Brooks. Start the clock. Well, after making his mark in the horror and western genres, Mel Brooks turns his satirical eye to sci-fi with Spaceballs, a brilliant parody heavily inspired inspired by the Star Wars franchise. The film follows two space renegades on a mission to rescue a kidnapped princess from the clutches of the evil Dark Helmet, who's part of a dastardly scheme to steal oxygen from her home planet. Right from the start, Spaceball sets the tone with rapid-fire one-liners and sight gags that range from the cleverly witty to delightfully cheesy. Brooks brings his trademark of reverence and love for the absurd, breaking the fourth wall and taking some well-aimed jabs at Star Wars' rampant merchandising in one of the standout current jokes in the movie. The special effects and set design are also noteworthy, crafting an immersive space adventure that's not only visually engaging and hilarious, but also backed by a legitimately adventurous plot. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the intergalactic hilarity that is Spaceballs, because nobody did genre spoofs quite like Mr. Brooks. Stop the clock. My final rating for Spaceballs is 4 stars out of 5, and my view and recommendation based on Spaceballs is Airplane from 1980, directed by Jim Abrahams. David Zucker and Jerry Zucker. Thank you for listening and keep on watching. Till the next time from the film verdict, this is Matt Makuchi signing off. See you soon.